Hello! Today we're going to be multiplying with 2 and 4. Before we start, stop and make sure you have all your materials. Your notes, a pencil, a highlighter, and if you need to grab something, pause the video now. And remember, if you don't understand something, write a question mark next to it in your notes. So let's start with multiplying by 2. Multiplying by 2 is the same as doubling the other factor or the other number. If I have two groups of soccer balls and each group has 5, I have two groups of 5 or 2 times 5. And so I can think in my head 5 plus 5 equals 10 so I know the answer to my equation is 2 times 5 equals 10. I doubled the other factor. I doubled 5. When I'm multiplying by 4, I double the other number, so I multiply by 2, and then I'm going to double the product. So if I have 4 groups of 5 soccer balls, first I double the other number, So I look at just two of them, I'm going to double that, 2 times 5, that's the same as 5 plus 5, and that equals 10. And then I'm going to double my 10, because my other set of soccer balls is also the same as 2 times 5, or 5 plus 5, which equals 10. So I can think in my head, 10 plus 10, which equals 20, so I know that 4 times 5 equals 20. I doubled the other number, 5 plus 5 is 10, and then I doubled that. 10 plus 10 makes 20, and that's how I can get my product of 4 times 5 equals 20. Let's practice a few. Let's start with 6 times 2. So when I'm multiplying by 2, I double the other factor, so I'm going to double 6. And I can think in my head, 6 plus 6, and I know that equals 12, so 6 times 2 equals 12. Next, let's try 9 times 4. When I'm multiplying by 4, I double the other number, and then I double that again. So first I'm going to double 9. 9 plus 9 and I think in my head I know that's 18. So now I'm going to have to double 18. 18 plus 18. And if you need to rewrite this going vertically to help you add it up, then go ahead. And once I've added 18 plus 18, I know that's 36. So 9 times 4 equals 36. Let's try a couple more. 2 times 8. When I'm multiplying by 2, I want to double the other factor. So I'm going to double 8, or do 8 plus 8. And since 8 plus 8 equals 16, I know that 2 times 8 equals 16. And my last question is 7 times 4. And remember, when you multiply by 4, you double the other number and then double that again. So, for 7 times 4, first I double the 7. 7 plus 7. And I know that 7 plus 7 is 14. So now I'm going to double 14. 14 plus 14. And again, just like with 9 times 4, if I need to rewrite 14 plus 14 going vertically to help me add, feel free to do so. And then add it up. And since 14 plus 14 equals 28, I know that 7 times 4 equals 28. Now you try. In your notes, answer each multiplication equation. 
And remember, when you're multiplying by 2, double the other number. And when you're multiplying by 4, double the other number, then double that. See you guys next week.